Hi guys, it's me, Jennifer. I'm going to see if this works. Um, I got me a new tripod. tripod. It's a, a Rita cam. It's a table mount tripod. I've just been playing with it the last five minutes trying to make it stay <laughs> at this angle. Um, and I turned the camera around. So I probably can't zoom in again. So this is probably as close, close as I can get. I tried turning it around and I can't like get a full screen. I was able to do it a couple times, but the last video did, if I tried to make it a full screen, it kept zo it was zooming in on the program I edited in and it wasn't showing everything I wanted to show you. You know, the whole page and picture was just like, you now it could have been the angle, I don't know. So it looks funky. I didn't like it, but I posted it anyway because you know, I just want to show you. <laughs> this is what I do sometimes in the morning or mostly in the evenings when I'm spending time with my husband. We're just watching TV and I'll just grab a book and some pencils and just color. And that's kind of like what I'm doing here. I've I played, um, just got done playing Sims 2, pulled that out, started playing it, um, I was watching a video someone was doing with Sims 2, and I thought, oh, I'll play, and then I turned to watch, getting ready to watch some color videos, right now I have Tracy's coloring page up, I saw that she just posted it and so I'll take a look at that after I'm done with this um so again was it this morning I think it was this morning I was watching Biblio I gotta write this stuff down Bibliophile uh wow I really need to write this stuff down I was watching his channel and he was just coloring in this um, Har uh, uh, not this book but Hannah Carlson's book I've colored a few pages in here so this doesn't go with any of my color longs <laughs> I still have those books put aside I did do finish this page I was following along kinda with um, Dee Dee uh, and I have What else have I done? I think I did the, yeah, I did this. Well, not quite done. I was trying to do gems, but that didn't come out right. I don't know if you can see. Probably not. I can't zoom in anymore. Uh, I guess I'll need to get a camera. If you guys um, use cameras, they're not too expensive. Could you let me know what to buy? Um, I've looked at some, but the, I can't spend like eight hundred to a thousand dollars on the camera. That's just crazy. So anyway, um, I've got a few things I'm going to show you, but uh, so I picked out three purple pens, pencils, and I've already gone through and used the. I'm using my Arteza's pencils. Um, so I picked out a light, medium, and dark, and this is lilac. I've gone in and gone with the lilac. And then the medium is Ubi, maybe? Um, and I've done it. This one's completed. This one I just finished. Uh, I went that, did the outline in the second color. And so now I'm ready to do the third color, which basically I've just been... Um, doing this inside. Anyway, I wanted to feel what it was like to color with these pencils in this book. And it seems to be okay. I still have uh, I've done one whip and got one which was it? 
color your hoard. It was a whip. And so I got that done. It was the only the only thing I had got done in that book. Um, and now I don't remember what book it was. I think I already told you guys about it. So anyway, my husband is at a friend's house. They're doing something with some feed for the pigs oh, they're working on a little project together and so I'm just here doing your stuff you have to do every weekend or if you're really organized you do a little bit every day <laughs> which I don't I, I do the majority of it on the weekends which I don't like because then if we ever do anything, then all I'm fretting on is all the stuff that needs to get done. And I get overwhelmed because it's not done and now I'm out of time to get it done. Like last weekend. And we really need to go grocery, grocery, grocery shopping. You know what I mean? Alright, so now I'm going to go back over with the lightest color and just fill it back in. It's interesting how you add an extra layer to a color you've already had on there and it just like changes because this is the same color as this, this pencil, this lilac. But I put a second layer on and it's darker. I wish I could zoom in. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. But I just wanted to show you Kind of a little couple of different things that I've, I'm doing and I want to this is one of them um, so today is Saturday I kind of like coloring in circles I really normally don't color in circles because you can see the circle marks <laughs> and kind of like a medium pressure I usually do really light and make build up my layers but you know sometimes you just want to get a picture done and you don't want to get all fancy and sometimes you do and then I get overwhelmed like I still need to finish a whip I have the magical jungle because I want to post with the the color long that Samantha has and get that posted. I need to go read the rules and everything because I just like I'm probably doing it all wrong. Like the color my color your horde one. I need to go back and look I mean I got the right picture. I mean the picture I can post. I'm just not sure where I was supposed to post it. So if I didn't do it in the right spot but I need to go put it in there. I don't do a lot of these things. Mm, that one came out darker than that one. Probably because I was talking. Alright, so now I go with the medium, which is this one. Ubu? Ubi. Is that like a different language or something? I've never heard of that color. Or is it a flower? What is it? So, what have I done today? Mm. Right now I'm doing laundry. So I've done laundry. And I got clothes in the dryer. If you hear anything, that's probably what it is. The chickens are out playing. It's a nasty, icky, rainy day. Here in western Washington. Oh. I guess I still have my game up. I don't have it up. Alright, anyway, someone just went offline. <laughs> uh, and... So yeah, I think I'll just...
do housework. Um, we're getting like two dozen eggs every day with our chickens. And we're not selling them fast enough. Not like that we have a business of selling eggs. We just sell them to people we know or church or work and we're just not selling them fast enough. So I think tonight my husband does sound every Saturday he does sound for Gethsemane Ministries for their worship. So I think and they give out food to the homeless. So I think I'm doing this wrong. I'm going too hard. He's just going to take all those extra eggs. I'm not even sure how many dozen eggs he's got built up. And just uh, take it to the church tonight and pass it out. Because um, they set up a couple of tables for food for anybody that needs food or wants free eggs, you know, free farm fresh eggs. Normally we sell them for like four bucks a, a dozen, but we're just have way too, too many. So I'm going to give them away. I think that's what he's going to do tonight. And I want to finish this flower. And then, I'll show you. Remember I was going to make some dangles for my... Mm, pencil cases. This is a zipper piece. It goes down into the back, into a slot back there, and then you got to pull it out. So I did one last night. And I'm not the best at doing this stuff. I'm still a beginner at everything, really. Um, I mean, I've always liked art, but I've ne I never really dug into it after, basically, my father says, you can't make money off of that, because I used to really like art and be able to do stuff and... <laughs> well, I can't even draw a stick figure. <laughs> it just disappeared because I stopped doing it. Um, okay, back with my medium. That was my dark. Nope, not back with my medium. Back with my light. And just color this in. As soon as I get this flower done, I'll show you. What else? I'll show you what I did. Which, um, after I did it, I realized, you know what? I need more charms. Because I'd like to have some matching charms, and I don't. And I bought this case. I'll show it to you. Well, actually, I won't show it to you because I put it away somewhere. And I know it's close by. I think. For my jewelry making stuff. Because if you saw my room tour, I have jewelry on the desk behind me. And it's all together, but it's all separated. You know, in little different little things. And so last night when I was making these dangles, I was trying to find some gold colored eye pins. And I could have swore I bought eye pins and what are the other pins called? The flat ones in the gold tone. But when I was looking, all I could find was the, you know, silver toned colors. So I don't have gold caps. Anyway, I'll show you. So, I don't know, can you see that? 
it looks pretty. So now this becomes a whip, because I'm going to put this aside. <laughs> and um, let's see if we can work on, on the other piece. Okay, I need a marker of some sort. All right, I use this. There's a whip number. I should see how many whips I have. <clears throat> I don't have a huge amount of coloring books, but most of them are not colored in. I'm pretty sure. So I'm going to put this aside. And I want to keep these. I'll put these over there. Let's put this aside right here. And I'll show you what I was playing with. So I'm playing with these things. Remember I showed you I bought these at Joann's. And they had two different kinds, but I didn't realize that. These have like little tubes in them. I don't know if you can see that. It's kind of fuzzy. Oh, see? Now it's doing that in and out thing. I don't know how to fix that either. Sorry, guys. Ugh. Anyway, it's got this little plastic tube in there, and then there were some that don't have the plastic tube, but I didn't realize that until I rewatched um, Luisa's channel where she was making uh, cute paper clips with these and the dangles, which is the part I was doing. With the dangles, she was using the ones with the tubes. But with the other ones, with the uh, paper clips, she was just using a dab of hot glue. They didn't have the tubes in them. But anyway, and they don't come with equal amount. Just little puff balls. Like there's only one green one. And there's two pinks, but they're two different color pinks. And then there's a white one and a gray one. But there's also a dark blue, but you don't get a big one in the dark blue. So you don't get like an equal amount. So you get, and there's like three different sizes in here. So you get some this size, and there's some even smaller. Well, the dark blue, you don't get any. Well, yeah, you get one. And the green, you get one. Or two, I don't know. It seems to be bigger than... So maybe there's four sizes, I don't know. Maybe there's four sizes. But you don't get an equal amount, so... <laughs> so that sucks. Um, so what I was going to do... Um, let's put these away. Okay. These are the ones I had out, right? Yeah, use these. All right. And then I have some lobster claws I'm going to use. And I don't need that. And, oh, this is, I don't know if they still have it. These are what they're called. Simply Spring Construction. And these are beatable. The ones with the tube are beatable pom-poms, and the other ones are just, uh, I forget what this is. There's supposed to be 85 of them, but they're all, they're all mixed. And I got these at Joann's. And so then, I forget what these ones are called. <laughs> these ones are flat, like a nail. And I know you can't see, see it, because it's so tiny. And then other ones have an eye pin at the end where you can like stick something else in it. Anyway, these are the ones I was using. And they're not very big. So they're like, I don't know, maybe two inches. Yeah, two inches. Get in there. So let me go grab that. I'll be right back. Ah, round, round, round. Okay. 
So last night, I made these. And so I used a lobster claw. I used a jump ring. And then I have the eye pin. Basically, let me get the other stuff. And see, and it doesn't match. That's what makes me upset. Okay, so you take your little eye pin and you put some of these called caps. Well, I had like gold caps. I have silver ones too. But these, but it looked cute. And so basically, you have that. You stick your little pom pom on. And then I was putting another cap on. I was kind of like following her, um, Louisa's tutorial a little bit. Well, get me started anyway. They're all sticking together. Come on, come apart. Uh, there's like three of them in there. And then you put another cap. And then. Uh, yeah, let me show you what I did <laughs> again. <laughs> so I did that piece, and then on the end, on the bottom, underneath where the eye pin piece is, I put another jump ring and then a little charm. And I there's probably a lot of shadow, huh? And the charms I don't have enough to make them all look the same like this little heart is cute but I only had one heart and then I have a little house a little bird house uh, a little pineapple and a key but I don't have matchy matchy so anyway I did that because like I said right here it gets stuck in there, so I got that, and so it makes it easier and it's easier to grab. And it won't get stuck, and then it looks cute when you put it on your shelf, like so. All right, so you can't see very far, which is fine. All right, so what I was going to do is make some more with these ones. Now these ones, that's interesting. Huh, they're like backwards. Because if I open it, then they'll be turned the wrong way. All right. These ones have happy faces on them. But, and they're rubbery. I don't know if you have this case or not. But I want to take this off, and I think I'll put the four white ones on. And I don't have very many charms. Well, I might. I don't know. I might have more charms somewhere else. <laughs> You know, in the same area, but I'm. Now, who else? Now. Oh, so now she's playing four. Okay, so this. What is this? This should go in my. Sewing box. And so should these. Yeah, Jennifer. Alright, put those aside. Let's see if I can remember what those. What else do I have in here? Oh, okay. So I don't have very many charms. So like I have two butterflies. There's another plant back there. So I have this case that's kind of similar like this, but bigger. Where I was thinking maybe I should put all this stuff because I got it. I got. Bits and pieces all over the place. I know you can't hear me. Ugh. I've gotten bits and pieces, so I have. Like, what are these called? Spacers. These are. Um, these are chain mail, but they they're rings, but. Can use them as jump rings, but I noticed it's they're di named different. So this is all chain mail. 
find it at thrift stores. Gun metal jump rings, and this is jump rings. I don't know. See, some say chain mail and jump rings. I don't know if there's really a difference or not. So I have stuff like this all over the place. Not all together. Maybe I should do that. So now, and see, these ones are bigger. I have some bigger ones. Um, just different. Nothing matches. I have a few of different things, but not like four of each. I do have a seahorse. There's a seahorse. Uh, excuse me. This goes that way. And I have some like shell looking ones. There's another heart. Anyway, I think I'm going to use this. I have some um, ocean stuff, but this is the only one that looks like this. So I think I'll do that. And this is a spacer. So what do I have? I need like four. I mean, I guess I, I, guess I can use four keys. I have two. But they're not all the same. Two hearts and two... I don't know, other kinds. So I, have, I only have two butterflies. That's the sure. So that's the fish. You see, they go the wrong way. There's a little frog. Another seahorse. Okay. And then I had, looks like three little houses, or bird looking houses. And I used one already. These I got from the Dollar Tree. Um, I think there are key rings and they had different they had like three or four different charms on them and so I took that other heart and put it on the other used it this is a different heart but anyway I should go find more of those and I have a couple else so I guess I'll use the keys I was gonna use the white And I guess I'll use those keys. What do you think? I need to buy more charms. That's what I think. And I also have some beads, too. But I don't want to spend... Yeah, this is a little piece of chain. This is a little tiny bag. Huh. All right. So let me attempt. I Like I said, I'm not really good at doing this or anything done it a few times. I've made one pair of earrings. Um, I got my little tools out. I need a lobster claw. I need four, right? So I probably won't do all four on here. Let's see, do I have four? Um, okay, I do have four. I have more lobster claws somewhere else. I have a couple different things and big ones too. So nothing's matchy matchy, as you can tell. Spacers. Okay, get those out of my way. All right. Let's see if I hurt myself. <laughs> Hopefully not. And I use these for cutting. These ones. These are, are new. I forget what these are called now. They kind of are on the bottom. I don't know. I haven't used those much. All right. So, how do I get these things off of here? My goodness. It looks like I can expand that. Huh. All right. I won't work on that right now. But it looks like I can get those little happy faces off. Okay. And what I'm not really good at, oh, where's my other, there it is, it fell off already. The chickens are nearby. 
Yeah, it doesn't look like I'm going to get a garden this year. Because I told my husband I want my garden to be protected from these chickens. Because they eat everything. And so I didn't get much last year because they ate everything. And I'm trying to get this in here. <laughs> but I can't see. Everything's tiny. Come on, get in there. Like so. And so, I'm not really sure how to do this. I've been just winging it, but it's not correct. So I've been just using this, and I've been bending it about, I don't know, a little less than half, half an inch maybe. I don't know. I kind of hold this down, and I bend it 90-degree angle. You gotta hold it down because they, they flop all over the place. And then you get your little cutters. Anyway, if anybody has this stuff, you guys are probably better at doing this stuff than I am. And I close my eyes and I try to grab it. Ah, and my arm is still weak. I have no strength. Really. Okay. So then. I take these round, these round ones, and I grab it. This is really awkward. I grab it and I twist up. I'm doing it wrong, I know, and I just keep twisting because I want to make a circle and a loop, you know. And right now it's still open. Go away, rooster. Okay. So then I see that it's it's pushed forward, so I need to bend it back. So just grab it. And I'm probably doing this all wrong, but I'm doing that. Why are you making so much noise right outside my window? Ugh. really hard to see too because my eyes aren't the best and it's really tiny stuff that's what the magnifying glass are for but, but then you won't be able to see all right so I'm just trying to close that loop and I know you probably can't see and I can't really see because my eyes are bad. So, anyway. So that's that. And now, I need a jump ring. And I have copper, but I don't have the gold tone, as far as I know. I could be totally wrong. They could be somewhere around. I don't know. So with jump rings, take two, or if you're strong, you use your hands. And you're trying to, there's the opening, the jump ring, you twist. And like I said before, I'm not, my arm has no strength. So you twist and you put it, put it through there and then you get a lobster claw and you put it through there also. And then you just twist them back together and you want them to join so there's no hole so you kind of just work it. Well, that's pretty good. 
I guess it did pretty good. Yeah. Because I couldn't even find it. Okay, so the other end. Get another jump ring. I have different size jump rings in here. Gotta make sure that I get them all the same size. Okay, so I have another one. And you open the twisting. You get your little key, and so I'll get a big one. And I know it doesn't match. And then you grab it and you twist it. And you want the whole to seal. Okay. Oh, I probably shouldn't have done that yet. <laughs> Give me. All right, open it back up. Twist, and then you grab the other end and you put it through the hole. Then you twist them together, like so. It's a cute little dangle. And I'm gonna make four of them I think I'll put put them like this, and then I have to get these out of here. Is it? A, it's not a jump ring, huh? I don't know what they're using. I wonder if I can open it without breaking it. I just need it open a little bit. Don't break it, Jennifer. I think I got it open a little bit. Yeah. Got it off. So now... Uh, I'm going to close it back up a little bit. Alright, because I don't need... And these are little jump rings, too. I mean, little lobster claws, so it's big enough. Barely. All right. Okay, yeah, it works. So anyway, what do you think? That'll help. I'll get these things off of here. I'll make three more. And if you guys aren't on, a, uh, what do you call it? Following me on Instagram, go ahead and check that out. What is my name on Instagram? I think it's just, let me check. You know how you use different names for everything, so let me see if I can find myself. Hmm, I don't have a shortcut build for it. Hmm, but if I go to my channel, go to my channel, I think I have a link. Yep. So if you go to my channel, Homendinger Homestead, in my banner, there's a link to my Instagram page. So anyway, that's where I post my pictures and like I posted a picture of the one I did last night. And when I get this one done, I'll post it. So there it is. So follow me over there too. I don't get on Facebook a lot um, anymore really. I mean, I do, but not really. So anyway, I'm going to go and finish that. And I don't know. What do you think? You guys like it? Tell me what I need to fix. <laughs> I promise I won't be offended. I know I need to work on my camera and editing and things. But like I said, if you guys have a camera that you use that's not really expensive, please let me know. I mean, I think the picture was better turned the other way, um, but I couldn't stretch it out right. It was messing with my editing. I don't know. All right. So anyway, that's what I'm doing. I'm going to do that today, and I'll probably go back. I'm going to watch this video. And I probably need to work on Magical Jungle so I can get that posted. Because I know Samantha really wants more people to... 
post some pictures. She's a little sad, but there's not very many that, you know, we're, we're small channels, so it just takes time. <laughs> it takes a long time sometimes, especially with me. I'm not that great. All right, guys. I'm going to talk to you guys later. Have fun. Bye-bye.